Hello, in this video, I'm going to discuss the qualitative characteristics of useful financial information. And we have two. Number one is the fundamental qualitative characteristics. And number two, we have the enhancing qualitative characteristics. And I will first talk about the fundamental QCs. For the fundamental qualitative characteristics, is what make financial accounting information useful to users. And for the fundamental qualitative characteristics, we have two. Number one is relevance. And number two, we have faithful representation. There will be relevance if there is a capacity of the information to influence a decision. Or we can say that the information we have here is material. And for an information to be relevant, it should have predictive value and or confirmatory value. Now what is predictive value and what is confirmatory value? There is predictive value if the information improves the prediction or forecast of users. That's predictive value. Now for confirmatory value, there is confirmatory value if the information confirms or corrects earlier expectations. So again, there is relevance if there is predictive value and or confirmatory value. So you can have one of these two or both. The second qualitative characteristic, faithful representation, is related to reliability. And it inherently follows the concept substance over form. So given a conflict between the accounting and law, you will be siding on the accounting. And an information will be faithfully represented if you are reporting what is actual. To do that, we need to know the ingredients of faithful representation. For the ingredients, we have three. We have completeness, and then free from error, and lastly, neutrality. This is also called free from bias. The information is complete if all necessary information are there. The information is free from error if there is no error or emission on how you describe the information. And there is neutrality or free from bias if the information does not favor a specific group given various groups. Alright, so these three, completeness, freedom from error, neutrality, or freedom from bias, make the information faithfully represented. Alright, just to recap on the fundamental qualitative characteristics, if you want an information to be useful, it has to be relevant and faithfully represented. Now, let's have the enhancing qualitative characteristics. Unlike the fundamental qualitative characteristics, the enhancing qualitative characteristics do not make the financial accounting information useful, but rather enhance the usefulness of financial information. Again, these characteristics do not make the information useful. They just enhance the usefulness of the financial information. So for enhancing qualitative characteristics, we can use the mnemonic VCAT. So for letter V, we have verifiability. Letter C, comparability. Letter U, understandability. And letter T, timeliness. So these four are our enhancing qualitative characteristics. Now, let's have the first one, verifiability. An information will be verifiable if the majority of independent experts 
agrees to the information or there is a consensus among them about the information. Now, for the second one, we have comparability. An information is comparable if you can compare the information internally and externally. And for this one, you will be looking for similarities and differences. And this is permitted by an accounting concept called consistency wherein you will be using the same accounting treatment given the same items. And then for the third one, we have understandability. And this refers to the form and term used. And here there is an assumption. You are assuming that the users have a reasonable knowledge about business. So for this one, what you do is just present the information how they should be presented. You know that the users can understand the information because you're assuming that they have a reasonable knowledge about business. And then for the last one, we have timeliness. An information is timely if it is available to decision makers in time before they make their decision or decisions. So that's for timeliness. Again, for the enhancing qualitative characteristics, we have four, verifiability, comparability, understandability, and timeliness. And that completes this short video on qualitative characteristics.